1.3 Factors affecting reaction rate Factors affecting reaction rate The first one is particle size Concentration of reactants Catalyst And temperature Particle size The smaller the size of rating particles Means that the bigger the total surface area Are exposed for the reaction to occur a greater area causes a greater frequency of collision. Therefore, it has higher rate of reaction. This is because the more often they collide, the more successful collide they will be overall. For the reactants that have bigger surface area, will make the collision occur frequently so it will make the reaction rate increase means that dust and powders react faster than the large pieces next Concentration or pressure As the concentration increases The frequency collision increases Thus increases the rate of reaction On the top, we have the sample with lower concentration of reactant. So, there are less number of particles, means that they have fewer number of effective collision. Next, it's temperature. We will discuss the factors affecting reaction rate on temperature. When the temperature increases, the average kinetic energy of molecules increases. The number of reactant molecules that possess energy greater than the activation energy or EA increases the rate of reaction increases we will discuss the factor affecting reaction rate on temperature look at the Maxwell Boltzmann distribution curve this curve actually shows the number of particles as the y as it plot against to the value kinetic energy x as it. The area under the curve shows the total number of molecules in the samples. The y area shows the particles that do not have enough energy to react. The shaded area shows that the particles that has greater than or equal to the activation energy. The area under the curve at T2, which is occur at the higher temperature, as we can see, this area is larger than the area under the curve at T1. Means that at higher temperature, the rate of reaction increases. Catalyst 
is a substance that changes the rate of reaction without itself being used up. So the functions of catalyst is to provide an alternative pathway with a lower activation energy Ea for the reaction. Lower activation energy means that more reactant molecule will possess kinetic energy more than activation energy. Thus, the reaction rate will increase. We have two types of catalysts. The first one is homogeneous catalyst. So homogeneous catalyst is exists in the same phase as the reactant. Refer to this equation. For 2H2O2 aqueous, produce 2H2O liquid plus O2 in gas. The suitable catalyst is example Br- in aqueous state. While heterogeneous catalyst is a catalyst that exists in a different phase from the reactants. For 2HI in gas, then produce H2 in gas plus I2 in gas. The suitable catalyst is platinum in solid state. Arrhenius Equation The Arrhenius Equation can be used to relate the effect of temperature and catalyst on the rate constant K. The original form of Arrhenius Equation is listed here. K or rate constant is A times E raised to the negative Ea over Rt. A is, an, A is a frequency factor that we will not use of to calculate this value. K is a rate constant. Ea is activation energy. R gas constant 8.314 joule per mole per kelvin while T is in absolute temperature kelvin to cancel out the unit of temperature per kelvin in the gas constant R Arrhenius Equation The Arrhenius factor measures the number of collision occurring every second between the particles. E to the power of negative Ea over Rt is a measure of fraction of effective collision. So we will write the Arrhenius equation as ln k equals to ln a minus ea over rt or log k equals to log a, log a minus ea over 2.303 rt. That's all. Thank you.